there is something that we that we call scarring in the sense that um, you know when you have a crisis uh, and this was a pretty severe crisis, uh, you generally don't uh, make up the ground that you lost um, uh, during the crisis. Um, so uh, some countries in Asia um, uh, are already bigger uh, than they were before the pandemic, and and China is one such country, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but rare is the case uh, that you have uh, a country after a major dislocation, uh, such as the one we've gone through, uh, that is going to be larger at the end of the day, say three or four years after, um, uh, going to be larger than was projected for that country prior to the cataclysmic uh, event. And what um, we are seeing for Asia as a whole is that over the medium term, uh, something like five or six percent of Asia Pacific GDP is more or less permanently lost. That is the scar that is inflicted by this pandemic. It is much less severe for the advanced economies. Um, that number is, is on the order of one and a half percent. Um, and it is, uh, you know, you know, in the at the high end, around six percent for the emerging markets. So, so there is this scarring, and the scarring uh, comes from um, from uh, you know many sources. If you just think of what what growth is made up of, it's made up the evolution of the capital stock, it's made up the evolution of the labor force, and it's made up of the evolution of productivity. And all of those uh, factors are likely to contribute to that scarring. Uncertainty is uh, an investment killer. And there's a lot of uncertainty about the course of the pandemic and, and what is going to happen in the future, and that is holding back investment. There are discouraged workers uh, that, are, that have left the labor force, and we're not sure when and if they're coming back. And we don't know um, uh, how resources are going to be uh, reallocated across sectors in the future, whether they're going to be concentrated in digitized, automated, high-tech sectors with, uh, with highly skilled workers, or whether they're going to languish in um, low-tech, low-productivity services uh, that, that might not contribute a lot to the aggregate productivity numbers. So, so there, is, there is a recovery, but there is scarring.